What's up guys, I'm Vern. I'm Hannah. Welcome to another edition of Pokeboy Production Channel. So, back to some unboxing videos. I don't know how many more we've got, but this one took two years to come. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> At least it came. <laughs> yeah, that's true, true, true. <laughs> but, you know, I haven't had really bad experience with Kickstarter, though. Know? Yeah. But, you know, at least now it's here. Yeah. And I mean, you know, I waited long for it, but we'll see how it goes. And uh, Henry, you know what it is? Nope. Well, <laughs> it's a surprise. It's kind of a fun little gadget toy. You'll see. Keep watching. All right, Henry. Start it up. Okay. Let's see. Yeah. I don't know what new gadget Vern has. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we haven't unboxed in a while, so yeah, I don't know what new gadget uh, Vern gets. You know. Yeah, I saw this on Kickstarter. It might be Indiegogo. I forget. It's been so long. Indiegogo. I don't trust Indiegogo. At least they're even still in business. Uh, yes, they are. Indiegogo. I don't trust. Them. <laughs> 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 it's so. Look at this. Hold on. Let's see. And put this down, hold on. What does it say, Henner? And it says the next dimension of gaming. Ooh. Here. It's called, oh, here. It says the Wow Cube. Wow Cube. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what is this, Vernon? It's like a Rubik's Cube. Rubik's so Cube? So all four, uh, one, two, three, four. Six six sided cube, right? Uh huh. Um, each side has a like an LCD fan screen. Uh huh. And it's all like a, a cell phone, pretty much. Like, but it, it rotates. It's like a Rubik's cube, pretty much. So but, uh, it's a video game cube. I, 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 call, I call it a wow cube. How do you play with this if it's a Rubik's cube? <laughs> oh, you'll see. It's pretty interesting. It's what uh interested me so I, I'm going to check this out okay <laughs> Renan is wacky game <laughs> okay here he goes all right so what's inside what's inside is we got this big ass big box or a cube this must be the this actual product the, yeah that's the actual product and we got what is this? Uh, what is this? A container, I guess? What is this? Cube Cubios. Oh, it's travel oh, case. Oh, it's a travel case. Nice little yeah, if you want to bring that around, big, yeah. big thing around and just your thank you letter or thank you card from the company. Cool. Yeah, sincerely yours, Wow Cube, Cube System. system. Ooh. Mm. We're so happy you chose Wow Cube System to entertain you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Sounds interesting. Yeah, I also bought this because my nephew is getting into like Rubik's cubes, so I think he'll like this, especially when it comes to video games. So Ooh, nice see. slide through. Okay. <laughs> Here goes. I'm guessing this is like the instruction manuals and other things. Yep. Uh, yep. And he has, oh, look at that. There's an e-card, Vern, if you want to buy more stuff. $50. Yeah. So you could back, pretty much buy games. So I think I got the Space Invader Edition. Space Invaders. Uh, <laughs> I can't even pull it out because it's so slippery. Oh, there you go. Just, there you go. Just, just I don't pick it up like that. <laughs> There's more boxes underneath. Yeah, I know. That's why I was trying to be careful. And here it is. It's cute. <laughs> wow, cute. Wow, cute. Look at that. <laughs> Slippery in there. Uh oh. Yeah, I know. That's why I was careful trying to uh, <laughs> pick it up because, you know, I didn't want to break I it. It gets smudgy because, you know. Well, it's. What is that? Is that memory card or something? Oh, uh, that's the, the charger. charging. The charging system. Okay, sorry, yeah. charging port. So I don't know what it's supposed, how are you supposed to charge this thing. Uh, I think it's one of the holes there somewhere. One of the holes there, right? There you go. Maybe that's it. I don't know. <laughs> I guess this is where you put it. Yeah, you could. Oh, there it is. Oh, we actually accidentally turned it on. Oh, sorry. <laughs> it's wow cube. I guess it goes here. I don't know. I don't want to break it. <laughs> <laughs> but, but yeah, so far that's how it is. And the rest here is, I guess, cables. Mini boxes of 
cables and other accessories here. What is that? Let's see. Uh, this is the the plug for the charger. Yep. The AC outlet plug. Mm. Other wire, mean? It's probably the wire. Yeah, most probably. Probably Type C, I'm guessing. Uh, yeah, it looks like a Type C cord. From the back of the the charging port, it is Type C. Ooh, this is interesting. It's a ball. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you're gonna have to read the instruction manual. What's uh, that for? I have no idea. <laughs> it's like one of those fidget toys. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I'm guessing this is a cord now. Watch it be another shape. No. This is right. oh, oh, this is a European cord. International. Yeah. It's an international cord. If you want to charge it and bring it internationally, you got the cord. At least that, yeah, that's good. You don't have to worry about it. They yeah, thought of everything. Mm hmm. Where's the company from, Vern? Do you know? Uh, I think it's US based. Ah, it's US based. Yeah. And I'm guessing this is the, your Type C. Yes. And you have. That looks like some kind of. It's a, it's a Phillips screw head. Yeah. It's or, a pi you know, Phillips head. I'm guessing you might have to. It's something maybe you have to open this, maybe? I don't know. Mm. <laughs> we'll have to read the manual. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but yes, so that is. Uh, See, says Go ahead. Hi. So what do you think so far, Henner? It's, it's interesting. It's weird. <laughs> <laughs> it's I, I feel like it's so sensitive or because it's slippery. It's glassy, so it's slippery that I want to be careful that I don't want to drop this thing and Yeah, it's actually animating and it says twist to continue. Twist to continue. Oh there. I twisted it. Four. We will start in four, three, two, one. Uh, twist the cube. Twist the cube once. Mm. Hold on. Uh, there. Uh, oh, just keep twisting. It's tell so basically right now it's just telling Heather how to twist the cube. I guess you are trying to break it in. Yeah. There. Nice job, he <laughs> says. <laughs> it says double tap. Where do I double tap? Oh, there. Tilt the cube and collect all shapes. Tilt. Tilt. Are you following the arrow? What? Collect Col all shapes. How? How run? <laughs> <laughs> oh, there. Excellent. <laughs> I did it. Uh, yeah. Uh, so uh, I'll probably put some video here showing you the ins and outs, how this works, and play some games maybe. So, uh, yeah, maybe we'll charge it and uh, be right back. So, this is the carrying case it came in. But, yeah, this is compact, small. Oh, there's more things in here. Uh, cable, Type C cable here. No, oh, I think this is the. Oh, okay. Yeah, he just put everything in this little uh, carrying case, but. Yeah, this will fit in your everyday bag. I wouldn't suggest putting it in your pocket. It's going to be a big bulge, but it's nice to have around when you need to carry your wild cube. So I just downloaded the app. Here it is. You can download several other games. Make sure you guys, if you pre-ordered it, you probably got the $50 gift e-card. I used it up already and I downloaded several games, but... A quick look at it. There's uh, several apps already in the store, and um, yeah, it looks pretty cool. News, home. There's a couple of other games that I might pick up, but so far so good. Make sure you guys download it, connect it through Bluetooth, and you guys should be on the way. Right now, it's uh, downloading a bunch of games, a bunch of apps that I've just went through the store. Comes with a nice cleaning cloth they could use so you can get smudgy especially if your games start getting intense and you start sweating <laughs> which is probably me but yeah it looks cool so far so uh after this i'm going to show you guys how this works run a few games and uh let's do it so i got it on dock mode and if you want to charge it make sure you flip the switch right here to charge 
I should be good. And I think this just as a stand, keep it on like that. And uh, a lot of fun stuff with this cube. All right. All right, guys, so this is the wild cube. I think it is very sensitive to like the twist and turn. Maybe it's just a feel for it thing. Um, I'll probably get used to it. And uh, looks fun. I mean, it is cool and it's a different tech. But uh, if you are not a cube person like I am, you might not do as well. You know, you gotta really understand the rotations and how things fit. Most of these games are like that and there's like um you can move it around and just control everything so yeah i like what i see but you know it's gonna take time to learn a lot of these games which so is half the fun and i uh, hope to download more games and apps so that it is there it is the wild cube right Heather, what do you think one word interesting <laughs> I mean, it's very innovative, right? It's, yeah. Uh, very. If you're a tech person, you you're probably gonna appreciate like how this is built. <laughs>
like I think it's 24 screens, right, Hunter? I uh, I believe so. And it all spins and yeah. rotates, just like a Rubik's cube. <laughs> just like a Rubik's cube. But uh, all 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 the screens are very interactive. Like everything is touch friendly. You shake it and it does stuff. Does everything. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I didn't know who thought of this, but good job, brilliant mind. Pretty much. Yeah. This is. I think this is the first generation. I think if this blows up, this will probably be in people's. Living rooms, <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe. Yeah. He has, a, you know, honestly, it has a hefty weight because of all the, of course, the mini monitors or mini screens and all the, uh, you know, inside like the tech, all the, you know, graphics card and other stuff. He has a, it's, I would say it's about what, two couple, to three, two to three pounds. pounds. Yeah. yeah, it's not like, it's not light like a Rubik's cube, but because of all the, you know, the tech in there, it's pretty hefty. Yeah. yeah so and slippery too because it's a <laughs> it's a monitor very mini shiny. mini yeah very shiny and glossy so it's a mi a lot of mini monitors so um it's a little be you know it's a little slippery so you got to be careful you don't want to be walking around playing this and you drop it say bye bye to it because it's an expensive product i'll tell yeah. you that much uh i bought this for i think it was like four four maybe four hundred something like that really four hundred three hundred four hundred wow yeah <laughs> It's, it's pricey, but this was two years ago. I haven't bought anything in Kickstarter in the Gogo in a long time. So that's when I was on a binging spree. I was buying everything on Kickstarter. <laughs> wow, <laughs> that cute. But, so that's why I kept uh, emailing them, but they were they were upfront about it and saying that it will come out. So, that's good. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, and uh, if you're a programmer and you know how to like code, mm -hmm. you could probably make games for it. Like uh, I think they, there are more at the store that you could buy. They give you a gift card, so yeah, you could buy other stuff mm -hmm. too. And um, yeah, you could download the app. In, in in the app, you could download more games. I guess I don't know how much games that they have released ever since you know this has been released. But yeah, it says that you could download more stuff. Yeah, so you probably see it. I'll do a little highlight video of all the games that it's included, mm -hmm. and. Um, I think you could also set this up as like something in your bedroom and have like a clock here or like oh, really? the weather oh, showing. That's interesting. Like that. Yeah, so it's it's multifunctional, just not a gaming cube, but its its main purpose is to be like you know educational and fun. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, if you got the if you got the cash, it's not cheap. It's cool though. It's it's a tech. You know, tech is never cheap. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, I'll leave all the information down below. It's called the Vacuum. So if you're interested, go buy it. Website's down below, like I said. So, uh, Heller, last words. Yes, please don't forget comment, subscribe, <laughs> and hit that button. Ding, ding, ding. See you guys. Wow, cute. Wow. <laughs>